In this reaction, we have the combination of uranium metal with fluorine gas to give UF6, and we're asked to determine if A, this is in fact a redox reaction, and if so, B, what are what is the oxidizing agent and what is the reducing agent? So to answer the question of if it's a redox reaction, uh, it goes together with what is the oxidizing and separately the reducing agent. So we have to compare the elements on the reactant side with the elements on the product side in UF6 and see what if any change has occurred in their oxidation states. So starting with uranium, we see it's just uranium metal and therefore it has an oxidation state of zero. And for fluorine, it's fluorine gas, it's fluorine in its standard state, and so therefore fluorine has an oxidation state of zero as well. Now looking at the product side, we see first starting with fluorine, we note one of the rules of oxidation states is that fluorine in compounds with other elements is always assigned an oxidation state of minus one. Now with six fluorides present, the combined total of negative charges is six. So in other words, negative six has to be balanced by a positive six charge which means that the oxidation state of uranium is plus six. So with that being said, what clearly has occurred is that uranium metal has lost electrons, fluorine has gained electrons to form uranium six fluoride. And with this being the case, then uranium has been oxidized and fluorine has been reduced. And to answer the question being asked of us must be the case that the oxidizing agent or what is reduced is in fact the fluorine. So the oxidizing agent or the oxidant is fluorine and what is oxidized or in effect the reducing agent is uranium. So I'm going to write down reductant or reducing agent for uranium. So the combination of uranium and fluorine gas results in the oxidation of uranium, the reduction of fluorine to form uranium 6 fluoride.